Hello everybody, I'm Chris with JVC and today we're going to update the firmware to version 3.1. As you can see, I've got a flash drive and I've got the complete folder with the firmware copied onto that flash drive. Now we're going to take the flash drive and we're going to put it into the connector on the projector, just like that. And now I've set up this little workstation here, so we're going to go into the menu and we're going to go to software update. And it's telling me here, uh, should take about 15 minutes. And it's telling me we're gonna update from version D 3.1, which was uh, some preliminary firmware to the actual final version 3.1. So I'm gonna say yes. And now you can see, looking at the projector, the lights are blinking very slowly. And uh, as the firmware update progresses, the lights are going to blink faster. And we'll check back in a few minutes. So now we're midway through, and you can see it's going a lot quicker. And it's going much faster now. Now it's really speeding up. And it finished. So at this point, I don't have any lights on the projector, but that's not a problem. Uh, here's what we do. So we're going to go to the back of the projector. And we're just going to push the power button. And you can see the light comes back on on the front. And... Uh, I'm also going to take out that flash drive because I don't need it anymore. And we're, uh, we're back in the game. So uh, with the Frame Adapt uh, firmware on there, I'm going to show you just a couple things here. Uh, so we're going to change the picture mode to Frame Adapt. And now you can see that on the main page, we have an HDR level control, which you can leave on automatic. And we now have a choice of frame by frame or scene by scene or static. Uh, try both frame by frame or scene by scene. And then uh, if we go into the more advanced menu, we now have a choice under uh, picture mode for cinema filter of either wide or normal. Wide is uh, uh, the same as the BT2020 mode with the other picture presets, and normal is the same as the HDR uh, preset. Uh, just uh, one other thing that I'm gonna show you in here. If we go to anamorphic, we now have anamorphic A, anamorphic B, uh, as well as anamorphic C and anamorphic D. And C and D are for anamorphic lenses such as the Panamorph, Talon, and DCR. C would be for uh, the widescreen content, and then D would be when you want to watch 16 by 9 content. And that's it. I hope you enjoy your uh, JVC projector with the new version 3.1 firmware. Thank you.